Hi, everybody. I've been called a lot of interesting names lately. Some names I had never even heard before, like Vimy or Vimma, which is someone who's a non-Muslim living in a Muslim country. Is that right? Some people think that I am a kiss-ass, Muslim-friendly, spineless worm of sorts. And they say that I am afraid to ask tough, real questions. So here's a tough, real question. What do you think about angry, hate-mongering Muslims? Mullahs that are waving their hands, saying death to America and all that. What do Muslims here feel about that? Some people say, well, those people aren't Muslims. And another person says, yes, they are Muslim. They can be hateful and still be Muslims. The, the Muslims that are saying death to America and let's kill Jews and all that sort of stuff, who are they? And how do peaceful Muslims deal with them? And what do they say about them? Are they, are they all Muslims just the same? Are the countries or regions where the law is kinder to Muslims and oppressive to people who aren't Muslims. Are there places where me, if I was a Jew, I was to go that I might get roughed up, beat up, or killed, or have to pay a special tax because I wasn't a Muslim? Where are these places if they exist? That in America right now, Muslims uh, have less rights in some areas than non-Muslims. In most cases, they have the same rights, but when it comes to going to the airport, or national security issues, Muslims have re less rights than Americans, American non-Muslims do. I know that in some other countries there's a caste system where there are some people who are deemed better than other people who have more rights. I know in Israel that the uh, Israelis say can vote and the, uh, the Arabs can't. Where is it that Muslims get an unfair advantage and the others don't get the privileges that they have?